Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kafuri FX. As you know, I'm a full-time forex trader. So today we'll be going to Nakuru NFP. Uh, just like I had announced a few days ago, that we up Azina Trade Center. As you know, our office is first floor. So come with me with a video to the vlog to Pole Pole. Let's go, guys. Tumefika hapa viewpoint So viewpoint na kwanga stop of a moja noma sana ya, ya majama Tum, Tumekimbia sana na igari, igari mbio Spot mode ni kuenda kuenda So guys tukua hapa viewpoint Kujia ni kwanza kidogo ni oneshe viewpoint Before Before tuendelea Nawani meana mafans hapa ni wengi kweli kweli Iki stop hapa muneza You can buy some coffee as hapa as you go on with the journey yeah, it's one good view. It's one good view. As uh, you are trading forex, remember to invest in land. Uh, that is one of the financial advices that guys are usually being given. Remember to invest. You don't know what will happen if forex will cut, will shut down today. So it's good that you invest in land, like this one you can see. So guys, uh, in the journey, I have my boys. Uh, I have my guys up at Konamanu. Manu na muju apa ane tu ayam Manu. Aja aji introduce. Ayam Manu. Nakuru, Nakuja. Hmm. I see. NFP, NFP live trading. Yeah, yeah. It's a good best, best, best. Yeah, this one is the first one. This is the first one ever. So we want to. The first event this year. Yeah, this year, yeah. So we want to cover all these events. We'll be doing this destination. Desti we will be calling them destination trading. Mm. So this is second February. So we will we'll also be going to another place uh, this month, guys. Comment up our comment section. But here ideas, the other places. Trakuja, Trakuja. Na pia tukona jamaa mungiri hapa. Yeah. It's done. Kuna tuzalima ni kama tujekwa na. What's up, guys? The Lano effects hapa. Yeah. Full time forex trader. Mm. Nakuru bana this mwaka tumefungua na Nakuru. Mm. The first time Nakuru mm. mko bless muzika. Mm. Mm. We are going to do major things over there. Yeah. Let's make profits, let's make money man. I can say for sure yeah. guys uh, we are going to Nakuru yeah. But we are actually ahead of time because Nasdaq is a buy. US 30 is a buy. German 30 is a buy. Gold is a buy. Yaani kitu yoyote yenye ni XXX USD. <laughs> you buy. Go fupi, mm. kichoyote kona USD mwisho. Mwisho. Eh, as the quote, uh, quote currency. Yeah, quote yes. currency. Mm. Yeah. Alafu kichoyote yenye sasa USD ni huku kwingine yenye ni base currency, base. something like USD chef, USD JPY, USD card. Everything that is looking like that is a sell. We'll be teaching you guys there how we have known that uh, but you know to be experienced in the market for the longest time ever. We have like two, three years in the market. So, to a safari, we are just few kilometers to Naivasha and then from there to a land up or Nakuru. Fanya mambo yetu. Best in the world. If I 
could give you more than half a year. Yeah. So guys, uh, we are here at Vic Mark Hotel. Could you any one of the setup will in a car? And so guys, this is the venue. Looking very good. It's a good one, it's a good one. So I guess this one is the podium upper. And then uh, I'm seeing my guys wanna set. We're expecting guys to keep on coming and then we'll be starting like from uh, maybe 12 noon, one, one noon. Well, I mean 1 p.m. Let's just wait and see. Notice all the time it so tunataka breakfast hapa kidogo kwanza we get some energy as wait for nfp ana gold ikielekea wapi gold kaka I will be sure. You're in a pure buy. What did you do? It's a good idea. I'm going to get 20. 2055. You're in a sugar. I will be sure. I'm going to get a gold, but I'm going to get a gold. But let's wait for the news and see. Uh, people are still uh, and coming to the venue. It's just the upstairs. So we'll come. We'll, we'll, after the breakfast, we'll be going back there to continue with the live trading. Remember, this one is destination trading episode one, 2024. Exactly. So see you guys during the live trading session. I'll give you more than half a
So for me, when I started, I did not trade. The first trade in the Akele Kwanga GBP USD, and I made $2.02. dollars And you come early for Nyama Choma and Kekula Nyama, and you can't issue Kule Nyama Milere. I don't need to talk about Kule Nyama. I was able to study the NASDAQ in a 3D one, and then I was able to I've been so held up with it. Because the first the first amount of money and she make big sun at a go, it was from a mere seven dollars to fifty four thousand Kenya shillings in a day. So of course if you're if you're seeing that something from seven dollars, all my life your time scored Meshika at ten K. But you shiku you could Meshika to nine K is less a ku pigisha kura. So kura ili pigisha kwa liquid is all uh ye PC. And that may be pigisha is uh, is on. That is the highest amount of my partner before then. But that day, the partner 54,000 has come And you can know Air Force Young, we are your time. You need to manage your time, other trade, the Kiran, you can share to manage your head faith. You just start, start line. So from then, the Makwatu, I, I find Nasdaq analysis here is somewhat more simple compared to the others. Because you can also, you can now. It's only companies that okay, they are more wealthy than the US start. You can elect to come Apple, Tesla, Microsoft, those ones. So there are things that are very simple to understand. So for instance, if you can ask a question, Leo, Apple, Wakileta Simpia, iPhone 16, Nasdaq Kitabaya made a sell. Even too simple. Another question before I hand over to Musa. Yes. Was 173. We had 
other focus reading of 168 focus is the reading that we are expecting to happen. So we are not sure, we are just expecting it to happen. But when the news came out, it came out at 216. So meaning that the dollar will bear will sell. Will it bear or sell? It will gain strength then. So that is what happened in January. So as of today, if you get a lesser reading at this place, something that is lesser than 216, the dollar will keep on falling. Right now we have done a check of analysis and we have seen that the dollar is on a is on a sell. Now, it's selling right now, it's just moving by the current and the normal market factors and condition right now. But with the news, the news will come and push it down or up further. Doesn't it scare you? Like it scares me. What do we do? With all the possibilities, we don't think about it. We don't think about it.